What's up, y'all? It's Big Rob TV again with a second pickup video for today. I didn't want to fake y'all and be like, you know, go change shirts or something and make it seem like I, I did two separate videos, two separate days. Nah, two videos today. You know what I mean? But uh, here's what we got going on today. Oh, yeah, by the way, if you're reading this on Too Fresh, you know, shirt, uh, where did I get this from? I can't even think of who I got this from right now, but Bobby Fresh, Bobby Fresh, Bobby Fresh shirts, uh, rocked with these boys today, Jordan 11 joints, the Georgetown low boys, very dope sneaker, uh, anyway, um, got another one that I've been waiting on, the previous video was one that I was really waiting on all year. These are some that I've been wanting forever, forever. And I got to give another assist on this one to my big brother again. Not only did he, uh, not only did he ship these to me, I had to ship them to him because, you know, had to order them from stateside. These come from finish line. Um, but he also uh, hooked me up and let me know that finish line released them early. So finish line released them early. If you guys know anything, you know these boys came out and they were 220. And he hooked me up and I, I went and I ordered them. We called, got on three way. I got my discount on these boys too. So I did not pay that 220. Man, let's get on into them, man. There's that. Oops, I'm all excited. I'm about to show y'all the box. Y'all don't care about that box. What's this? This is my receipt from Finish Line. Yep, Finish Line receipt. Throw that out too. Anyway, Jordan 3 box right there. As you can see, Jordan 3 box. There's the bottom of it. Not sure if y'all care about that, but there's the bottom of it. And these are the Air Jordan 3 Retro OG. White, fire red, true blue, size 14, of course. Retail, $220. Man, box a little ashy. Uh, go ahead and get into these babies, man. I know some people was talking about the quality on these aren't as good as these. So... Uh, and yeah, these, this, the leather on these boys is really good, man. This is some really solid leather, man. And these weren't 220. So, of course, you know, it's my first time seeing these in hand. So let's go on and get into them and see if I agree with what everybody is saying. Are they worth the 220 price tag? We're about to find out. And there they are. The True Blue Jordan 3 Retro. Let's go ahead and get both of them out for y'all. Oh, my box falling apart. There it is. The True Blue 3s. This colorway right here. Man, I've been waiting on this. Because, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm late to the sneaker game. But I do my research. And... I would go back and see sneakers from the from the past, from before, and I would be like, man, I wish, you know, that one would come out so that I can get it because, you know, I wasn't in the sneakers before. But, man, these boys are worth, they're worth it, man. These are worth the wait, man. Let's get into this left boy as I always do. And let me grab this one as well. All right, so... That leather, nice and smooth leather right there. Uh, no elephant print on the tongue. Very good grade of leather here. This one's not bad, man. To me, at least right here. Right here and right there on this. To me, they feel the same. They feel the same on those two areas. Of course, there's this. We take this out. Uh, Oh, they got paper and a shoe tree in there. All right. Um, so I can feel 
this is probably where everybody is talking about. I can see that. I can see that. This area here and around where there's the tumbled leather on the side here and right there, that doesn't feel nearly as good as this. That's a dip, like a softer leather and then smoothed out. It's not the tumble leather. I get it. I see what people are talking about as it relates to that. Is it still dope? Yes. Is it well worth the one, what did I spend? 198 on these instead of that? Originally, it was about to be 240 something after tax. Is it worth the 198? Yes. It's definitely worth that price. Um, so I ain't tripping, man. I like it. You got your... Your Jordan Air on the inside there. Jordan Air on the inside. Or, excuse me, Nike Air. I'm sorry. You got your Nike Air on the inside there. And then on the back, you have your Nike Air. And that Nike Air that's on the back right there, this is what everybody is paying that extra money for. This is what Nike raised that price for. Because the originals, I guess, had that on there. So, you know, they hiked the price up for to give it that true authentic feel. You got your red and gray on the bottom. Oops, turn it that way. Nike on your bottom there. Very dope, man. Very dope. It's well worth my money, man. I know some people, uh, some people might disagree. I know um, I watch Damn D's videos and... Man, DMD shitting on these <laughs> for the price. He shitted on the price. And he didn't shit on the shoes. He said he liked the shoes. But he shitted on the price on these, man. And, you know, everybody has their opinion, man. I feel him. I feel him. Like, that 220, especially since, you know, you can probably wait it out and that go down. So I feel him, man. Some people say that. But is it still worth the cop? I would say so. If you really, really, really want it. Go for it, man. I know people cop phone posits, and I don't think a single pair of phone posits is worth 230 or 250 You know what I mean? I don't think a single pair of those phone posits are worth that price. But if you like them, cop them. You know what I mean? Like, cop what you like. You don't got to base your opinion or, or your cops on what my opinion is or what whatever other sneaker, you know, review channel is. You know, cop what you like, but um, I, I can say that I can agree with what Dan D was talking about as far as the quality. It isn't, it isn't, um, it isn't as soft as this. It isn't. This is some good quality. So this probably should have been this price, but hey, I ain't complaining. Um, I got, I get them from under retail anyway, either way it goes. So I ain't, I ain't really tripping. Um. But that's it, man. Just wanted to do another quick video for y'all. Finally got these in hand. Shout out to my brother again for, for the double assist on these boys. And um, thumbs up if you like my video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will make sure to holler at y'all in the next video. Peace.